You know, it's only three or four months, I think, but I like to move real fast. Uh, so I do have things that I want to achieve. And, and the, the first thing I'd say is to let the staff do what the staff wants to do. Um, our first staff meeting was two hours long, and all we did was talk about ideas. And at the end of the meeting, Richard Turner, Turner who you probably know, Richard said, you know, we're hemorrhaging ideas, which was a great thing for him to say. So we picked a bunch of ideas out that we were going to try and jump off and do some new stuff. I want to increase student involvement, for sure. Love to be more vocal about the need for the community to support uh, the student athlete. I like to say that, that you guys, you're a student athlete. You all travel all over the country and you wear Little Rock on your uniform, on your jersey, on your warm up. And you're not just representing UALR, but you're representing our hometown too. And so it's okay to be a graduate of the University of Arkansas or a graduate of, of Southern Mississippi or anywhere else and support those. But if you live and work here, if you make your living here, you really need to support this program as well. So I'm trying to push that out there as much as I can as well. We went and met with uh, all the student orgs a couple weeks ago and talked about a lot of ideas. There are things students want to do and we're gonna let them try. Uh, tailgating's a big one. Um, we tailgated last Friday night at women's soccer. Had 1,200 people there for a women's soccer game. We're gonna tailgate uh, at the October 24th soccer game. We're gonna tailgate at our first men's basketball game, which is a double header with women's volleyball. So we'll have volleyball followed by basketball. We're gonna tailgate there. Uh, we're putting some new activities in during the timeouts to get students involved on the court doing things. Um, Patrick Newton came up with a great idea. We've played the same music in the arena, the recorded music, for a long, long time. So I think we're going to run a little social media campaign and um, let uh, the students pick the playlist. You know, what do you want to hear us play? Gosh, you know, we've got some great supporters. We've got some great folks who are donors. They come to games, they buy season tickets, they travel and go out of town. We just need more of them and I go back to what I said earlier you know support your alma mater that's great but come support this program too because the student athletes represent the city and they do so for, in, I should say in an exemplary fashion I mean you make good grades you're good citizens and you compete real hard and, and compete for championships it's a great product we just need to expose that product and be more uh, open about asking people to come and help